What's up guys, welcome back. Okay, the balance is dropped and uh, this is one of the decks that got like one of the biggest hits, or at least yeah, the biggest, I believe the biggest hits on our most um, recent DCG ban list. So it should be effective today. Let's try it out. All the new, at least yeah, the like rescue rabbit uh, got back to three. But again, biggest hits with dinosaurs. Um, yeah, before dinosaurs were like, okay, not the best deck in the form of True Draco and Zodiacs were both better. But you know, dinosaurs got like a couple of tops, a few tops at regionals, YCS level, but not, not too much, right? And now into the new format, dinosaurs all, all yeah, are of course also weakened uh, next to the other two decks. But I still think that True Draco is um, much more consistent and um, probably better than dinosaurs. Um, then again, okay, dinosaurs still have tools. They lost one of their biggest tutors the earth true king monster day is like like you can play uh, a decent replacement in the water true king monsters you could play more true kings but still um the draconic diagram is still at three terraforming is still at three you know all raptor is still at three the, um the boss monster is also at three not really sure if you want to main deck tyranno at three with you know the the revolution pill i believe the name is um the deck has still a lot of possibilities opening trish into enter blathy near i believe the name is to rip your opponent uh, from two cards during the first turn is still quite strong or you know ending with calamities after you uh, trished your opponent again all strong plays but still they still have the uh, that yeah, pretty much the same weakness as before ish uh, is uh, ash uh, if you get ash blossomed the right time ash blossom could stop you in your tracks and then yeah it's just your opponent can uh, can establish his board and then it's very hard for you as a dino player to overcome that so my card choices and then as always a few example duels is the return of rescue rabbit again not really sure if Rescue Rabbit uh, has a place in a uh, true King Dinosaurs or you know Dinosaurs you might want to play it pure. Um, it still, it definitely still needs more testing but I'm only running three normals. My explanation for this is that um, I've tried Sabersaurus as well, Cabalzools as well as more water monsters for the water true King monster. And of course the option to go for Bahamut Shark into totally awesome. But you don't want to run more monsters. At least I, I had the feeling that adding in more monsters like Cabazul's Sabersaurus for possible Mrs. Radiant. It, it just adds more monsters that needs a normal summon. And again Dinosaur is not really a control deck. So you want to um, end the duel fast. And then uh, one Rescue Rabbit is enough right. The small downside of, of running uh, like only three normals is of course... You know how it goes, right? You will always open with one normal, and if you draw into the second one, your bunny is dead. But uh, yeah, still, I think the risk uh, could be taken. One bunny is enough, and you know one bunny. Establish your field. Uh, yeah, you know, you will see it in a couple of moments. Uh, the Water True King is in here. You might want to run or could run like Winds, uh, the Wind Witch engine maybe with the Wind True King monster as well. Uh, miscellaneous is sadly put to one, well, definitely one of the biggest hits, if not the biggest hit, to Dinosaurs. It was a very important tutor. Um, I'm playing level 3 Jurak Tuner, uh, it gives the option for Asian Fairy Dragon if you want, but I believe the level 1 Tuner, the Jurak Tuner is also fine, because it opens up the option to go for your Chen Bear, I believe the name is, your level 5 Synchro. But still, the level 3 also gives you option to go for Trishla. Uh, Ancient Fairy Dragon, again, with the Jurek level 1, could go for a uh, Crystal Wing. So, again, that's something uh, you might want to consider. Triple Gofu is also a recent addition here, since Gofu wasn't hit on our TCG list. So, let's try it out. The biggest weakness of the True King engine in general is Link Format. You only have one extra monster zone, uh, so you need so, uh, something like Kofu. Kofu gives you uh, pretty much like like the, the Link 3, one card Link 3 monsters, Deco Tarker opening up two extra spaces. But still, it needs more testing if Kofu has a place in a dinosaurs. It all, it's also like a, a non-dinosaur monster needed for the evolution pill to, you know, special summon your uh, Tyranno to the field. Uh, other than that, um, yeah, let's see a couple of example games. 
Alright, um, yeah, most of the time it's just like a couple of combos, I think pretty much already ha everyone uh, knows about them, but again it's still showcasing that the deck still has possibilities into the new format, probably not as the, one of the best decks, but maybe as a tier 2-ish deck that has the potential to do well at maybe regionals level. Um, again I decided to main deck Ofu before link format, it wasn't needed of course, you could like end with Calamities backed up with Lagia or Dolka probably like yeah but uh yeah go for just gives you the the option to go for decor talker and you know have like two extra monster zones ready to go for something like calamities backed up with uh laggy again a very strong play very strong and solid opening move but um yeah, then again, go for it's not searchable, so you have to hard draw it. And then again, the other two, or at least yeah, the two card combo that can lead to Trishula into Enter Platinir. <laughs> um, it's quite easy, right? You still have three terraforming, you still have a triple di yeah, diagram. Uh, triple uh, yeah, Rota for the dinosaurs, triple Ovi Raptor, you know, the, 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 the engine itself is still consistent, but it's very fragile, again, one well-timed Ash Blossom could stop you in your tracks. Um, another example, I believe, not really sure what the different option was here compared to the first game you saw. Um, again, get the search, get the special summon search, the water true king monster. Yeah, pretty much the same here. Again, I need that fire monster on my side of the field. Yeah, that's of course one of the biggest stunts that you have to run more um, fire monsters, maybe. Or, you know, get your uh, miscellaneousaurus uh, much quicker, of course. Um, yeah, indeed, it's pretty much the same opening board, right? A couple of differences. Um, but still a very strong opening board. Eventually I think I'm going to Lagia yeah, the Ignis. Uh, Ignis is at 1 indeed, definitely one of the stronger monsters, but you know the hit to Knuckles definitely hinders through Dracos. I believe this is not the Spellbook version, but I, I probably play the Spellbook version with, you know, um, yeah, the true Draco engine, but still one return definitely also hurts the deck. Another example, uh, this opening at this kind of terrible uh, to uh, yeah, Rota for dinosaurs. Um, the kaiju, um, I think the only player is to go for Lagia like, to negate the summon. Here is where Knuckles definitely hurts. Knuckle has 2 5 attack, right? If I'm not mistaken. So that already would have forced out the Lagia like, yeah, negation, but no, it's not needed. Um, his, uh, what, what is it called? The Maiden? It's not It's not a threat. Okay, he can search a monster, but still Lagia like, is still alive. I can negate everything, even a summon of a possible masterpiece. So let, let's just leave Lagia like, yeah, on the field. Um, I try to go for game, but he does have a floodgate trap all, which is all fine. I guess I still have the Kaiju in hand. Um, still have a field that's uh, all good here. I can just attack for a game. So yeah, just yeah, play testing into the new format. I start, the opponent starts off. Pendle of Magicians are a couple of duels ready as well. Um, pretty much the same opening move, but I believe no Kofu indeed. So I still think the two card combination of the field spell and one of the babies. Um, yeah, or at least yeah, the, the, the better baby, right? That still has three in the deck. Leads to, you know, first turn Trishala into Enter, Blathimir, um, or Calamities if you want. You know, it depends, right? Ash Blossom is still very important. Yeah, going into the new format, especially with Spirals released, Ash Blossom is still very strong. And if Spirals get released, you might want to dust off, well, now even, uh, your Troll and Lockbirds as well. Um, get the Bunny and eventually Pill for the Conductor indeed, or at least Tyranno, and that's, that, that indeed should be enough. Um, otherwise, yeah, probably would have went for the Rank 4 Exceed play. Um, yeah, previously I had, uh, what is it called, uh, Totally Awesome and Bahamut Shark in the extra deck as well, but I don't think you need it since um, it does take up two spots in your extra deck and you're already packed up extra deck and I believe just going for, yeah, instead for Totally uh, at least, yeah, instead for Bahamut Shark into Totally Awesome, going for Lagia immediately is pretty much the same, right? Um, so you're saving two spaces in your extra deck and uh, yeah, thanks to Decor Darker, that definitely is an option. You know, Decor Talker and Rescue Rabbit can definitely lead into totally awesome uh, play. Then again, yeah, totally awesome can send itself from your grave back to the extra deck. So you could potentially, if your Bahamut Shark survives, potentially summon another Toad. But yeah, that seems a bit... Um yeah, situational as well. Again, Calamity's first turn is so, so strong against 
pretty much every deck, right? Um, there is, yeah, pretty much always the same, right? Just showcasing the possibilities right here. Pendulum Magicians, Ravering Eyes at 3, the deck is... Ooh, this is such an underdog deck going into new format. Pendulum Magicians is definitely very, very... Yeah, it's, it's a super, super strong deck. Ravering Eyes at 3 gives them more tools to work with. But um, yeah, it's a deck that we can definitely not underestimate. He makes a very good opening board with Avian as well. Ah, oh, that sucks. Um, and also the first turn Omega Ad. Of course, yeah, he knows that I'm playing Dino. So the first turn Dweller is definitely an option. Maybe going for, uh, what is it called, Tornado Dragon Ball, well, yeah, yeah, maybe against Dinosaurs, against the Diagram, but still, the first turn trailer definitely hurts, okay, go for is fine, it lures out the Avian, I can drop my Conductor Tyranno, but you know, we still, at least he still has a scale up, he gets the Omega back, oh, Omega is also still at 3, Man, the TCG panelist, right? Um, yeah, okay, Ignister is still at 1, I believe, and that's game over, right? I believe he still has his normal summon, so it's not going to matter too much. Last example, if I'm not mistaken, I get to start this time. Uh, run into an Ash Blossom. Okay, luckily, luckily, had the second copy ready. This is definitely one of the reasons why I'm contemplating on running set rotation as well. Um, and possibly the, uh, what is it called, Last World? You know, the new, f well quote-unquote new field spell of um, dinosaurs do you know have more at least quicker access faster access to your draconic diagram or at least more consistent access to a diagram um okay calamity's first turn a bit unfortunate here the opponent not having that a great of an hand and then again the Trishla did rip, I believe, the Black Fang Magician, which was important here, as you see, with um, the continuous spell and the level 7 Magician in his hand. But still, um, yeah, final thoughts. Um, dinosaurs, it's not dead, but it's definitely much worse. At least it's it's worse, of course, um, because it lost, it lost its best tutor, the Earth True King monster. But I'm not, I'm not really sure if Rescue Rabbit has a place in this deck. Um, I definitely want to end in Gold Sarcophagus and uh, the Giant Rex, I believe. But again, I, I it's already at uh, 43 cards, but you might want to drop the Rescue Rabbit engine. And maybe play the Gold Sark and, to ch and of course, Giant Tracks. Giant Tracks, of course, goes very well with your evolution pill. Uh, the Trap Card, uh, what is it called? That um, World's End or something like that? Survival's End, indeed. Could also be an option if you want. Um, but other than, yeah, the Rescue Searcher card isn't really too great. Because I think you have to reveal three, right? Um, and yes, set rotation I already uh, explained. Um, okay, guys, feel free to leave feedback as always. And as always, thanks for watching. And feel free to leave a comment or a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave them signing out. Peace.